Hey yo everybody! Welcome back to the Positive Vibes channel. We're so happy to have you here. For all the first timers, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our Positive Vibes. Today we're talking about how to absolutely crush your day right from the moment you open your eyes. You know those mornings where you wake up feeling like you already need a nap? Yeah, we're banishing those. We're diving into the top 10 morning habits you need to avoid to start your day right. And trust me, some of these might surprise you. Get ready to transform those mornings from blah to bam. Let's kick things off with the ultimate morning frenemy, the snooze button. We've all been there, right? Those extra nine minutes seem like a good idea, but trust me, they're doing you dirty. Hitting snooze throws your sleep cycle out of whack, making you feel groggier. Instead, put your alarm on the other side of the room. You'll be forced to get out of bed to turn it off. And once you're up, you're up. Okay, hands up if you're guilty of this one. Reaching for your phone first thing in the morning. No judgment here, I do it too. But let's be real, scrolling through social media before you're even out of bed is a recipe for stress and anxiety. Think about it. You're starting your day bombarded with news, messages, and everyone else's perfectly filtered lives. Not exactly the most zen way to kick things off. Instead of reaching for your phone, try reaching for something else, like a good book, or spend a few minutes meditating or just enjoying a quiet cup of tea. Give your mind a chance to wake up gently before you unleash it into the digital world. Trust me, your mental health will thank you for it. All right, folks, let's talk about the most important meal of the day. Breakfast. Seriously, I know mornings can be hectic, but skipping breakfast is like trying to run a marathon on an empty stomach. You're just not setting yourself up for success. Think of breakfast as the fuel that kickstarts your metabolism and gives you the energy you need to conquer your day. It's like giving your brain a big old high five and saying, let's do this thing. And no, a sugary donut doesn't count. Aim for a balanced breakfast with protein, healthy fats, and some complex carbs. Think oatmeal with berries and nuts, avocado toast with an egg, or a smoothie packed with fruits and veggies. Your body and brain will be thanking you all morning long. Okay, coffee lovers, this one's for you. I get it, that morning cup of joe is practically sacred. But before you reach for that caffeine fix, do yourself a favor and drink a big glass of water. Drinking coffee on an empty stomach can wreak havoc on your digestion and even amp up those anxiety levels. No one wants to start their day feeling like they just rode a roller coaster on an empty stomach. Water, on the other hand, rehydrates your body after a long night's sleep and helps flush out toxins. It's like giving your insides a refreshing morning shower. So, make it a habit to drink a glass of water before you even think about that coffee. Your stomach and your mood will thank you. Speaking of water, let's talk about the importance of staying hydrated. And no, chugging coffee and soda doesn't count. Think of your body like a plant. Without enough water, it wilts and can't function at its best. Dehydration leads to fatigue, headaches, and brain fog. So, make it a habit to sip on water throughout the day. Keep a reusable water bottle and refill it a few times a day. All right, who's ready to get those bodies moving? I know, I know, exercising first thing in the morning might sound about as appealing as eating broccoli for dessert, but trust me on this one. You don't have to run a marathon or anything unless you want to. You overachiever, you. Just a few minutes of light stretching or exercise can work wonders for your body and mind. It helps wake up your muscles, gets your blood flowing, and releases endorphins, those feel-good chemicals that make you feel like you can conquer the world. So, put on your favorite tunes and do some jumping jacks, yoga poses, or just dance around your living room like nobody's watching. Chapter 7. Sugar Rush more like sugar crash. Let's talk about sugar, folks. I know, I know, those sugary cereals and pastries can be tempting, especially when you're short on time. 
But trust me, starting your day with a sugar rush is like riding a roller coaster. Fun at first, but then comes the inevitable crash. Sugary foods spike your blood sugar levels, leading to energy crashes, mood swings, and cravings later in the day. It's like setting yourself up for a mid-morning meltdown. Instead of sugary cereals, opt for protein-rich options like eggs, Greek yogurt, or oatmeal. And if you're craving something sweet, reach for a piece of fruit instead. Remember, breakfast should fuel your day, not sabotage it. All right, let's talk about organization people. I'm not talking about color coding your sock drawer though, no judgment if you do. But taking a few minutes each morning to plan your day can make a world of difference. Think of it like this, you wouldn't just hop in your car and start driving without knowing where you're going, right? The same goes for your day. Having a plan, even a loose one, gives you a sense of direction and helps you stay focused and on track. So, grab a planner, a notepad, or even just the Notes app on your phone and jot down your top priorities for the day. Break down big tasks into smaller, more manageable steps. Trust me, a little planning goes a long way. Okay, raise your hand if you're guilty of this one, running around like a chicken with its head cut off in the morning. Yeah, me too. But let's be real, rushing through your morning is a recipe for stress and disaster. When you're constantly rushing, you're more likely to forget things, make mistakes, and just generally feel frazzled. Not exactly the best way to start your day, right? Instead of hitting the ground running, or should I say sprinting, try waking up a little earlier and give yourself enough time to ease into your day. Enjoy your breakfast, savor that cup of coffee, and maybe even do a little meditation or reading. Remember, life's a marathon, not a sprint. Last but not least, Let's talk about the importance of starting your day with a positive mindset. Remember, your thoughts are powerful. If you wake up thinking, "Ugh, I'm so tired, or this day is going to be the worst, guess what? You're probably right. Instead of letting negative self-talk sabotage your day before it even begins, try starting your morning with some positive affirmations. Look in the mirror and say, I am strong, I am capable, I am going to rock this day. It might feel silly at first, but trust me, it works. Positive self-talk can boost your mood, increase your confidence, and set the tone for an amazing day. So, ditch the negativity and crank up those positive vibes. And there you have it, folks. 10 morning habits to avoid to transform your mornings and set yourself up for a day filled with positivity and success. If you found these tips helpful, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and share it with your friends. Let's spread the positive vibes far and wide. And don't forget to subscribe to the Positive Vibes channel for more awesome content. We've got tons of videos on personal growth, mindfulness, and living your best life. Thanks for watching.